Now I've done videos where I've read people leaving me mean comments on YouTube, but let's take a look at my YouTube comments that I just can't figure out what they're even talking about. Welcome back to the Junk Room, everybody. It's me, the Junk Man, coming back at you with another video. Thought we'd just do a little lighthearted, fun video today to take a break from movies and toys and look at YouTube comments. Now, usually I do a series where I read my mean comments, people trying to make me angry. Oh, I'm upset someone says something bad about me on the internet. <sighs> but, you know, I don't understand why anybody would get mad at a stranger's comment on YouTube. Uh, but then... There's always been some that I usually just delete, but I've saved some of them, never did anything with it. It was just really strange YouTube comments that just made no sense. It didn't really have anything to do with the video topic. It didn't really have anything to do with anything. It was just rambling, and I thought, that might be kind of fun to look at. And maybe you guys can explain some of these and, you know, fill me in. Maybe maybe I just thought it was strange comments, but you can be like, no, no, this is what that's about, and explain it to me. So, well, let's see what I'm talking about. Uh, let's pull up this first one. Why I got to pay $10 to watch this stupid video from a redneck. Hmm. Now, now I'll give you, I understand the stupid video part. I do do some good videos. Say some stupid videos. I mean, I did a Saw parody. Remember that? Another day I did a video where I just talked really slow about droid figures. So I understand that. Redneck. I'm from the South. Maybe. I don't know. I don't see it as an insult. But if you think I'm a redneck, okay, that's fine. But... Why does he have to pay $10 to watch me? That's what I can't understand. $10? What? Who's getting the $10? I didn't know I did pay-per-view videos or something. I just, maybe you can explain this one to me. Um, for, let me. My camera's really screwed up and my monitor's really screwed up and it's throwing me off where I can't talk. I just keep looking at that, so give me just a second. Okay, sorry about that. Sorry about that. I know that's very professional, right? Let's look at another one here. Yeah, well, toy be like that same time dude. Try that again. Maybe, maybe it's, I know I can't read sometimes, so maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. Yeah, well, toys be like that same time dude. A toy be like that. Be like what? I don't know. Toys be like that. Same time. What's this? Okay, let's go to another one. Here's a little short one, short and sweet. Let's see what it says. How do I start the video? How did he make it this far on the YouTube to get to my channel to not even know how to start my video? I mean, he left a comment. And don't the video just automatically play when you click on the video? <sighs> ah. Hmm. Okay, here goes. Here's a good one for you. No. I don't remember doing a video where I asked a simple question to get a yes or a no answer, but this guy just left no. No. No what? Oh, here's another one for you. I have two buttons up shirts. I have two button up shirts. Oh, two button up shirts. I got that now. A shirt that you button up, you know, walk in, you look nice. Maybe something you want to wear at church with your Sunday shoes or something. A button up shirt. That's great. I have never done a video about shirts unless it's maybe talking, maybe in the video I talked about, you know, iron on shirts or t-shirts or something. I'm trying to sell t-shirts. This guy just wanted to let me know in the comments section. He has two button up shirts. I ain't trying to brag, but I got four. <laughs> I have two button-up shirts. Hmm. Let's look at another one. Oh, here's a really good one. Mama said you ate so that. One thing, is he watching my YouTube videos with his mom? Mom said you ate so that. Maybe I translate, maybe this means you, you, you know, like skater ate, people say that. Maybe it means you said ain't. Maybe that ain't is supposed to be ain't. Mama said, you ain't so that. So that what? Man, these, these are worse than the mean comments. The mean comments I laugh at. These upset me more than the mean comments. The mean comments don't upset me, you know, you know. Someone said something bad about me on the internet. Right, it's the internet. But these are so mind-boggling that I can't get them out of my head after I read them. They bother me and they pester in my head all day while I try to decode it and figure out what's going on. Let's look at another one here. We seen saw you from day Jerry Pole over four days, month. Go to that. 
See what I mean? It makes your head explode trying to read this and understand what's going on. Oh, calm down, John. Let me try this again. We seen Saul. Seen Saul. We seen Saul. You from day Jerry. Who's Jerry? Pole over four days month. Four days month. Got to that. Now, I do love 98% of all my YouTube comments, but man, some of you guys are probably drinking a little too much when you watch the junk, man. Like this one right here. Doomcock ain't never lied and never has been wrong. You just jealous. Well, at least I understand what he's saying here. He's saying that YouTuber, uh, fake newsmaker Doomcock is always right with his leaks. But Junkman, what about the time he saw leaks on Reddit and said he got it from an inside source and it was turned out to be right? And I'm just jealous. This is something that comes up a lot. If ever I pick on the Phantom Menace or I pick on anyone else that's a bigger channel, I will, without a doubt, there's like five comments I always get. Um, one of them, you're a Disney shield. You're guaranteed to get that one. And the other one you're guaranteed to get is they get more views than you. You jelly. Let's go on. Minecraft runs from the software for the loop. This got to be some kind of secret code, right? This is some secret code here. Minecraft runs from the software for the loop. It reminds me of something you might hear if you were in war and turn on the radio. You know, they always have like some kind of code going across the radio. You know, the, the bird flies at dawn and it's supposed to mean something. That's what I think this is. I don't play Minecraft, so maybe it means something if you play Minecraft. I ain't got time for silly stuff. I got Pac-Man games to play. Minecraft runs from the software for the loop. I don't know what the loop is. Maybe you can help me with that one right there. Dude, come no talks, but he not even spell good. There's someone's picking on, I think, the way I talk, I think. And he's also picking on the way I spell. Now, he did, I think, uh, looking at it, he did spell all the words right. That's better than I can do. Dude, come no talks. Come no talks. But he not even spell good. What is he talking about? Let's go to another one. Dude, you know Kenner made a snaggletooth that was blue and taller than the normal one? Now this one, this one here, I know what they're saying. I get it. I get what they're saying and everything, but why? Does he, does he watch my videos and think I don't know there's a blue snaggletooth? Nah, I can't remember exactly what video this one was from, but I can't, I don't remember doing a video where I acted, you know, playing a character like I didn't know about a blue snaggletooth. I don't understand why someone would leave this, me this comment. It's like, yeah, I know that. Oh, let's look at another one if we can. Here we go. Here's a good one for you. Star Trek. Nothing else. Just Star Trek. Maybe this is guy saw one of my Star Wars videos and thought, I'll upset that nerd. I'll say Star Trek. I like Star Trek also, especially if it's the next generation. So I don't understand what this is supposed to upset me or something. I was supposed to get, you know, in a geek rage. But no, I didn't. I don't, I don't really understand. Let's look at a couple things. I've got about three more. Here we go. I called her back, but Nana didn't take her to the, to the gynecologist gynecologist, I probably said that wrong, because she was pregnant from the fair. <laughs> this one had to be on purpose to just make me laugh, just to screw with me. Let me read that again. This one actually made me laugh. I called her back. I don't know who. He called her back, but Nana, sounds like her grandma to me, took her to the gynecologist. That's some kind of female doctor. I know that. I think it looks at the private areas when you take your bloomers off, but I could be wrong. Anyway, took her to the gynecologist because she was pregnant from the fair. Let me say that again. Because she was pregnant from the fair. I have to know more about this. I have to find out who left this comment. If I, I need uh, I need to find out more about this. this. This is the comment. I need more. I need to know the whole story. I want to know why Nana. Was Nana the one that got pregnant? Didn't take her call. So the guy called, she was pregnant. Nana's the one that was pregnant from the fair. Whew, that's going to be a toothless hillbilly baby for sure. Let's look at another one here. Why don't they make any Star Wars toys back in the day? 
Now, this is another one that's written good. I, I know what they're saying. It's not like words are spelled wrong or out of order or strange. Nope. Why didn't they make Star Wars toys back in the day? What does he mean back in the day? Does he mean back when Star Wars first came out? When they made the Kenner toys? I don't know what this means. Why didn't they make Star Wars toys back in the day? My whole video channel, 90% is me talking about toys of Star Wars they made back in the day. Whew. Some of these, I started to say some of these are the most annoying thing I've ever seen, but I've seen this. Wow, wow, we wow, 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 we wow, 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 we wow, 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 wow. That's annoying. Okay, let's look at one more. It's a long, confusing mess. Let's take a look. Well, I like the video was right. It was about toys, but there is my thing, like Star Wars is from the toy store, like the movie came from HBO in the 90s, but we really like that sum up the term of the page, maybe Facebook and Twitter right there over to there, be like, yeah, okay, then Star Wars was not even 70s, but 80s, and toy figure Star Wars for life, Joe and Todd arrived in the back of the groomer, but will be like that then me go right or I come to from end of be kind together C what the f I can't take this oh I can't take this shit anymore fuck hey jump man <laughs> channel popping though Thank you, sir, for that unsolicited testimony. <laughs>